This video is brought to you by FlexiSpot. Please stay tuned after this video for a special message regarding this year's Black Friday specials and additional promotions at FlexiSpot.com. You're doing great. Oh my. Oh my. I'm just gonna hit this. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh. No. Oh. Give me an update, Emily. How are you feeling today? I'm okay. I'm sore. I went to the gym. Mm -hmm. Might have overworked my muscles a bit. Okay. How you been lately? How's the neck? How's the back? Good. Next, 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 next. Okay. Back is also okay. I'm old now, so <laughs> I <I've laughs> I'm more brittle than I was in my twenties. Okay, you're doing great. I'm gonna uh, open this up so I can see your lumbar spine. Okay. Okay, let's push into your lumbar spine here. Do you have any pain, discomfort, tension? No. No? How's that one there? Okay. A little bit more? Yeah. You feel it over there, right? Yeah. What about one up? Do you feel it there? No. It feels feel nice. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, All right. Cool. All right. So it doesn't want to move to the right there. I'm going to palpate the SI joints here. We'll start on the upper. Let's start with the upper SI joints. Any pain, discomfort, tension here? No. Left, right. Which one more? They're both about even, I think, honestly. Okay, lower SI, right, left. Right. Right. All right, let's see what the muscles have to say here. Yeah, a little bit more tension. In I was going right to say side. it's my right. <laughs> okay, we got a little bit of tension, right. Got some partly glute, maybe some IT band stuff over there. Otherwise, that feels good. Pure form, this is okay. A little bit right there, right? Ah. <laughs> I just said a little bit right there, right? You know. Right. Okay, any other updates? Any changes in medical status, history? <laughs> Hospitalization, visits, traumas, injuries, surgeries. Um, I had two surgeries. Not anything like Go medically ahead. necessary though. Go ahead, what were they? I got uh, my tubes tied and then I got my boobs done. That's since the last time I saw you? Yeah. How's it on how's the pressure on your back? Any changes there? So I was gonna say actually the girls all at work, um, the ones with big boobs, they were like you're gonna feel different, and I was, I was like in your back, and I was like, yeah, 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 whatever. No, it really does. I feel different. My back hurts more. <laughs> I don't know if you saw this, but uh, there was actually uh, I did a video with someone who was having breast augmentation uh, difficulties. Really? And I adjusted her, and she felt so good that she got them redone bigger. She got them redone bigger because you cracked her so nice. That is great. <laughs> Terrible? Not terrible. This is usually the spot. Oh my god, right that's side, huh? yeah. My right side's been acting up. Alright, we have we have some tight muscles here for sure. I need to crack this, but we have some spinal muscles that are hypertonic and we need to open those up here. And let's see what else. We need to get this right. Glute, hamstring, lateral thigh, mid T spine to thoracic lumbar transition transition. And then we'll do some trap work too. This is lovely. All right, let's do a couple things. I'm gonna look. Okay, let your arms relax. Okay, the first thing you're gonna feel are my fingers on the back of your hamstrings, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, tracing up to the bottom of the glute fold, it's lower on the right versus the left. I mean, the right one might be tipped back like that. Okay, feet are even, and then looking from the top, there's no external or, external or internal rotation. That's good. Checking for hypertonicity in the standing position. It actually evens out a lot more over here in the standing position, but right there. Go ahead and stand up nice and straight. Close your eyes. Looking for swaying motions here. Forward to back sway indicates fixations in the pelvis. Lateral swing indicates hypermobility. I don't see a whole lot of swaying. Mostly forward to back. Pretty steady. That's good. Okay, you can stop. You can open your eyes. Can you touch your thumb to here? To the inside of your... Mm, pain, right? <laughs> yeah. 
All right, let's see this. I'm going to look for this sword fight anomaly, which indicates genetic variances. All right, so uh, you're going to feel my fingertips on the top of your hip right here, okay? One thumb on the PSIS, one on the S2 tubercle. Now go ahead and bend forward and touch your toes. Good, coming back up here. Hamstrings are tight. Yes. Checking the right side now. Go ahead and bend forward again. Come back up. Yeah, the sacrum is locked on both sides here, so we're going to have to adjust this. Now, we had lower right was the tenderness. You should still feel a little bit right there on standing. Yeah. And there is a little bit of edema in this upper left, too. It's a little feel out squishy right there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. This is going to be a little cold. Good, let the shoulders relax. Nice, gentle breathing. Pressure's okay? Uh Oh. 
excited. <laughs> it was very tense. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Almost there with the last one. Hmm. Oh, my gosh. Take your job. Gentle breathing. Which is okay. Mm -hmm.
Okay, nice, gentle breathing. Good, you're breathing. Good, I'm gonna focus your, on your breath right there. Give this a little push. Okay, on the front there. Pressure's okay up front? Mm -hmm. Okay, shoulders sinking, letting it all go, letting it all go. Oh. Oh. You're breathing, good. Let the shoulders sink in a little bit more. Let it go, good. Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh. All right, let's do this. Pull your belly button up to your spine. Pull your belly button up. Good. Now lift up your head. Lift up your head just like that. Oh. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> I'm going to help brace your low back with my knee like this, okay? Mm -hmm. yeah, we're just going to hit this. Oh. Breathe. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. <laughs> Keep breathing. <sighs> Keep breathing. You're doing great. Yep, that was perfect. Good, good, good. That was it. <sighs> All right, we're gonna help. That helps keep you, keep you stable. <sighs> it's not as bad on this side, huh? <sighs> Oh my freaking goodness. You're gonna feel great tomorrow. I, I'm honestly, I'm feeling, you know, I'm feeling looser already. <laughs> I'm excited. All right, let's do this. I'm like, go ahead and lift your right leg up in the air. Good, down, left, down. Which side was more difficult? This one, shockingly. Right side? Mm -hmm. The lower SI joint. There. Nice and gentle, take a deep breath in. Good and out. Good, the hips relax and shoulders. Oh. What? <laughs> hold on, hold on, one more time. The hips go. Shoulders. <laughs> okay, a little bit. Something was off there. <laughs> what? Hold on, come back to this way again. Oh, right, nice and gentle. Let the shoulders come up this way. Let the hip go. Good shoulders. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't
crazy loud. Bro. It wasn't, but there was something in it. I felt it. It was deep. I felt it in my soul. <laughs> it was deep. <laughs> Good. Shoulders relaxing. Oh! That was better. Okay, you're back. Okay, turn your head to the right. Back to center. Turn your head to the left. Back to center. Bring your right ear down to your shoulder. Center. Left ear. Center. All right, ready to get your neck cracked? Yes. Good. Excellent. We're right here, pushing in that direction, following the breath. Just that, you're doing great. Oh my God, dude. This is so <laughs> scary. <laughs> Sweaty, lovely, ready. All right, you're doing great. That was awesome for the first time. Second side is the same thing. We just follow the breath. Oh my gosh, that was so fast. You did it so fast. <laughs>
Here toast. Good. Oh my god. I think you cracked it. No. No? Relax there. Look, I can feel it. It's right there. No, no, let your leg go down. Oh! Sorry. stubborn sometimes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh I bet you need to let your feet <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I lower sphincter is two inches above the belly button. That was crazy. It's a barbecue. It talked, it did. Into your belly. Into your belly. <laughs> Into your belly. You're doing good. Keep going. Oh my god. <laughs> I like, I felt it. Yeah, because it was right underneath my finger when it happened. That was crazy. We'll follow the next breath out. Sinking in. Very nice. No. Very nice. No. Good job. Thank you. That was the scariest one for sure. <laughs> Alright, walk around a little bit. Let's see how it feels. Let's see how it feels. <laughs> I think it feels nice. <laughs> feel loose? Yeah. Good. 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 Relax. Good. Good. That was <laughs> easy. Push. 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 Okay. That side push. Here, put your feet on the ground for this section. <laughs> Alright, push here. She's weak! <laughs> push. Come on. Ah! Push. Okay, I'm gonna crack your ears. Dude, I tell people about this all the time. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, 
Relax the shoulders.
Hey everyone, thanks for watching this video. If you haven't already, please make sure you like and subscribe down at the bottom. Now, this video was brought to you by FlexiSpot.com and it couldn't be more aligned with the chiropractic message that we should be standing, keep taking care of our posture while we're working. And more on that in a moment. First, I wanna make sure that you know Black Friday sales are coming up. There's all kinds of deals all across the website at FlexiSpot.com and if you put in this special promotional offer, Flexi Spot 30. That's just for my viewers. That's just for the special promotion. Flexi Spot 30 is the code that'll get you an additional $30 off. And that's for the E7 desk, the E7 Pro, and the C7 chair. Now I have the E7 Pro. It was the first collaboration that I did for Flexi Spot was for the E7 Pro. And I knew right from the beginning. Just by the way that the E7 was packaged. They're an outstanding company. They do everything that it takes to make sure that you're happy with their products. From the shipping, to the product itself, which we're about to talk about, and to the customer service. So it only makes sense that as a chiropractor, I would want to work with a company that sells stand-up workstations and other ergonomic office and home products. And there is significant information to tell us something that's very obvious, and that is sitting for eight hours a day is not good for your low back. It's not good for your neck. It's not good for your posture. Now, we already know conclusively the number one reason that people miss work is because of low back pain. And we already know that the people who are missing work because of low back pain the most aren't construction workers, aren't laborers. I mean, of course they hurt their back too, but the number one occupational standard that causes people to have low back pain is sitting at a desk for prolonged periods. It's why companies are willing to pay for their employees to get stand-up work desks. It's because they know the data. Now, speaking of your work and office standards, if you work for a big company and you work for a big co corporation, I recommend that you go to your HR department and you say, look, I would really like to get a stand-up work desk. They may ask you if it's medical, medically necessary. If that's the case, now I'm just putting this out there one time, I'm gonna try this out. But if you work for a big company, a big corporation, and they say you need a, a letter of medical necessity, I've handed out hundreds of letters of medical necessity so that people's companies will pay for their work, their stand-up work desk. So if you work for a big company, let me know info at painreliefcare.net and I can supply you with a letter of medical necessity so that you can give that to your employer. Maybe they can buy you your flexi spot stand up workstation. Now, if not, if you just work for yourself, if you have a home desk, a home office, or if you just want to get yourself a desk that's gonna be healthier for you in the long term, the code chiropractic30 for an extra $30 off will work for the E7 and the E7 Pro on this Black Friday event. You know, but it really goes deeper than just back pain and neck pain and headaches. The research clearly indicates that prolonged sedentary positions are much worse for you than just your back and your neck. I mean, that's an important thing and back pain is debilitating sometimes for some people. But it also increases your risk of cardiovascular disease. That's right, you're more likely to have a stroke if you sit at a desk for 40 hours a week, then if you smoked a pack of cigarettes. They say that sitting is the new smoking. Now, there's also a desktop riser. Maybe if you don't work a lot at your desk, but you're still interested in having a stand-up workstation, or maybe if your work won't pay for one, but you really wanna get one at work anyway. The desktop self riser is a no brainer. It just goes right on your desk. It has the keyboard tray. It's got a hand levered hydraulic. It's a very well built product. And if you don't have the space for a full stand up desk, then the desktop self riser is gonna help your back pain. It's gonna help you reduce the risk of cardiovascular disease. It's gonna help reduce your risk of diabetes. Yeah, what else do we really have to say? Now you might be thinking, well, you can't stand all day, right? And that's true. You really can't stand all day long and shouldn't. And there are valuable stretch breaks, postural ergonomic considerations to have. But eventually, it is good to have a chair. FlexiSpot has the most amazing chair that I've ever seen in my entire life. It's the C7 office chair. It's customizable in almost, like the arms move up, down, in, out, left, right rotation. There's low back lumbar support that can move you forward in the chair, backward in the chair. It increases, decreases the lordosis. The headrest is perfectly positioned in the line. And if you're gonna have a chair, you really do want the C7 FlexiSpot office chair 
It's a beast. Now, I did eventually upgrade and I got the Mac Daddy, the E7L. This is the L shaped. I got the bamboo top with the white legs. It's a beautiful looking desk. The construction on this desk is so precise because they use industry leading equipment that involves some kind of laser technology. I don't really know how it works. I don't know how they build office furniture. All I know is when you look at the telescopic joints that are compressing and decompressing in that elevation table, you can just tell it's solid. And there's a 10 year guarantee on these parts. And the E7L and many other products on the FlexiSpot website are BIFMA certified. Now this is also something that I had no idea existed. It's the Business Industry Furniture Manufacturers Association. I have the E7 Pro desk and I have the E7L. I have the C5 and the C7 office chair. I have the desktop riser. I have the adjustable bed, which never even been anything close to an issue or a critique with FlexiSpot. I mean, this company is flawless. Since the moment I started working with them, every pro, even the kids chair, I have one of the kids ergonomic chairs. It's the coolest little chair and it would work for either a boy or a girl. It, it's just a great chair and it's adjustable too. And so that's a great thing about adjustable chairs for kids because they grow. So if you've been thinking about getting a stand up workstation, if you're working six, seven, eight hours a day at a desk and you're seated the entire time, I implore you, it's really my best recommendation that I can give to people is to get a stand-up workstation. And if you're looking in the market for a good stand-up workstation, well, FlexiSpot.com has the entire range that could suit almost anybody's needs. I mean, even just something as simple as the desktop riser, which will help your back, it will help your heart, it will help your pancreas, it will help you enjoy your day because it sucks to be in pain. If, if your back hurts at the end of every day, it starts to affect the other things that you do. It starts to affect your job performance. It starts to affect your, the relationships of the people you have at work. And so it's not kind of, it is a very big deal. Now the E7 and the E7 Pro are on sale for Black Friday. And if you use the code, FlexiSpot30, you'll get an additional $30 off that purchase. Now, you really can't beat it for the price of a desk that you can stand up and sit at, that has a guarantee, that has a warranty. The E7 and the E7 Pro are solid choices for a desk. I could be happy with the E7 Pro. I don't have 10 computers, but if you have one of those jobs where you have like five computer screens at once and like five different mouses and you have all kinds of things going on, then the E7L is a luxury item, it really is. It's a beautiful desk, there's memory settings, on the electronics. I've never had a problem with any of the electronics. I've never had a problem with one of the products. I've never had any issues with any customer service, never anything on delivery. I give FlexiSpot full five star recommendations to anyone out there who is considering a stand up workstation, or even if you've never considered it before, then it's time to consider it because if you sit for six, seven, eight, nine hours a day, it will eventually wear you down. Now, if we reach back far into history, we can see that stand-up workstations aren't something new, and it's actually been utilized by some of the most brilliant minds in history, some of the most brilliant people of human civilization. But I also know stand-up workstations will be the desk of the future as well, because when I worked and taught at Penn State University, when they refurbished their library and when they refurbished their computer labs, they outfitted entire rooms with stand-up elevation work tables. And the reason for that is because the data is clear. Insurance, company, insurance companies are the ones who have to pay for people to miss work, right? They do the research. They have the data. The number one reason that people miss work is low back pain. And that occurs most frequently in people who use prolonged sedentary postures at work. They're sitting in a chair at a computer. So whether it's the eccentric geniuses of the past, whether it's the insurance companies who are crunching the data on why people miss work, all roads are leading to the same place. And that is, it's better to be able to sit and stand. Stand up, get a nice little comfy mat, wear some good comfortable shoes, bounce around, be flexible. It's going to improve your health and also the quality of your life. I mean, it's not gonna solve all your problems or all the world's problems, however, one step at a time. And if it's just as simple as you have chronic back pain or you have chronic neck pain or you have chronic headaches or you're at risk for diabetes and heart disease and you have a job where you sit for six, seven, eight hours a day, FlexiSpot is a no-brainer. This is a quality company, they make quality products and there's an awesome sale and promotion going on right now 
for Black Friday. Use the code FLEXISPOT30 on the E7, the E7 Pro, and the C7 Office Chair. I have the E7 Pro and the C7 Office Chair. I recommend both of those products. I also recommend the E7L. I also recommend the Kids Chair. I love the adjustable bed and the bedside table. This is a great company. They guarantee all their products. I highly recommend them. Get over to FlexiSpot.com right now. Use the links below, use the code, get yourself a stand-up workstation, get yourself a good ergonomic chair, get your kids some chairs for their desks as well. It's a decision that you'll be happy with and that will make you healthier. Thanks so much for listening. I'll see you next time.